today I'm launching a very important new series on how to live in victory and take back whatever the enemy may have stolen from you or your loved ones. John 10.10 says the devil comes to steal, kill, and destroy God's blessings from all of our lives, and perhaps you've experienced this. I meet people all the time who feel like the devil has literally ripped them off and stolen their health, their finances, relationships, peace of mind, or some other important part of their life. But the good news is this. God has given us powerful spiritual weapons to recover everything the enemy has stolen from us. Yes, I said everything because that's what the scriptures teach us. As you join me on this exciting series, you're going to become a victor in Christ instead of a victim. What a difference. You're going to learn how to put on the whole armor of God and go on the offensive against the enemy. You'll be able to invade the enemy's territory and never again question the authority you've been given as a child of God. So get ready for a life-changing journey through God's Word. My friend, your whole life, I believe, is going to change as you pick up your weapons of spiritual warfare and you declare war on the devil in Jesus' mighty name. We're going to continue this series in the days to come. There are a few things I want to ask you to do to get the maximum benefit. It's going to help you if you have your Bible at hand, along with a notebook or a journal of some kind, so you can write down some notes or some of your personal thoughts. I also encourage you to browse through the many spiritual resources available on this website. We've designed them to help you grow in the Lord and to find a greater level of victory than you've ever experienced before. Remember the words of King David in Psalms 144 verses 1 and 2. He said, Blessed be the Lord my rock who trains my hands for war and my fingers for battle, my loving kindness my fortress, my stronghold, my deliverer, my shield, and in him in whom I take refuge. Yes, the Lord is your fortress. He's your stronghold, your deliverer. Whatever you may be going through today, take refuge in him. I hope you'll join me again tomorrow as we continue to just uncover this journey of recovering the things that the enemy has stolen from you. God bless you.